Hey, Scott, I've heard anecdotally that some of the big centers around uh, New Jersey, some of the, where, where they were doing lots of, uh, of vaccinations, that they actually, they don't need them anymore. They're, they're closing them down, and you can obviously still get uh, the jab at a, a lot of other places, but it's kind of uh, slowing down to a little trickle, but are we above 50? Are, where are we going to, in your view, where are we really going to, to top out? And then what do we do? And how much of that, add that to the people that have already had COVID? And, and do we need to worry again? Or are we at herd immunity at that point? You know, we might get to 60 percent of the population, maybe a little bit better than that by the fall. I think it is going to slow down. We're picking up about maybe two million new people a week right now. It's probably going to slow as prevalence declines, as as the risk, per, the perception of risk declines. People are going to say, well, I might as well wait to the fall to get vaccinated. So there'll be a bolus of people in the fall getting vaccinated on return to school, return to work. But as we get into the summer, I do think that rates of vaccination are going to are going to decline. Right now, we're picking up a lot because we're vaccinating kids 12 to 15. We've vaccinated about a million of them. We'll probably pick up some more there. Um, we've been sort of flat since the announcement of CDC, where CDC said if you don't, if you're vaccinated, you don't need to wear a mask. I do think flat is uh, better than where we would have been. Um, we're not up, but we're not down. So we're going to see vaccination rates decline. Right now, we're about at 50 percent of the American population. 60 percent of adults have at least one shot. I think, you know, Biden, the president Biden has said, well, he wants to get to 70 percent by July 4th. That's probably a stretch goal. They might just about make it 70 percent of adults by July 4th. So, you know, once we get there, we're getting closer to 60 percent of the public. I think as we get through July and August, we'll pick up a little bit more. And maybe as we get back into the fall, we'll be at around, you know, 60, 65 percent of the public has been vaccinated. Now, you have to layer on to that people who've been infected and infected in prior infection, while it doesn't provide in our estimation as good protection against reinfection, it does provide protection against reinfection. So we are getting closer to some semblance of, you know, what we would say is herd immunity. I don't think it's going to be true herd immunity when this stops circulating, but it's enough immunity in the population that the rate of transfer is very slow. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.